Let's go from one excellent performance to, I'm sure, another one. This is the girls' 60-meter hurdles in the center of the track lane five, Charmaine Walker. She has a third fastest time ever. She won the first semifinal, and she's from Plainfield, New Jersey. Her competition should come from Nicole Hoxie, who was the fastest preliminary runner with an 850 and the second fastest in the semis. It's Walker in five. And in three, it's Nicole Hoxie. In four, we got a spill, but Hoxie right there with Walker, but Walker at the line. Unofficially, 833 by 1 100th, a new national record with Hoxie just off. Charmaine Walker ran an excellent race. She got out of the blocks very well, and she stayed well within herself. One thing you have to worry about in this situation is some of the athletes forget that there is a race from the last hurdle to the finish line. And that was Kim Turco from Edison, New Jersey, who takes a spill. But right now, this is a two-woman race, and Charmaine Walker wins the race to the finish line. That was not necessarily easy. No, it wasn't. <laughs> uh, but does that bring the best out of you when somebody like uh, Hoxley's right with you? Yeah, it does. And I, I've been wanting that all year. Somebody to really push me and drive me. She made me work for it. So. That's the best thing about this meet, isn't it? You're back home, and it's hard to find any competition. you got to go somewhere else. Yeah, yeah, it is. I'm glad she, she pushed me. She pushed me all the way to the end. It was good. It was a thrill. Dominique Calloway had the old national mark of 834, run in 1996. But now it's Charmaine Walker, 1-100th better.